Uh, hello everybody, welcome to the next round of BTCC. Uh, round 3 I guess. Yeah, I think round 3. Um, I am your god and I'm joined by the graph remover. Say hi. Terve. And yeah, so it was interesting, interesting two rounds for BTCC when last time we did it. Uh, now we, after a break in the OC, now we can move on and uh, yeah, moving on into round three. Let's go straight into the qualifying and uh, no rain like in the top class. Yeah. So can I have screen share, please? Oh yeah, maybe maybe <laughs> the screen share is good for good for you. And here's yeah. thanks. Here's that. Of course, this is definitely all going live, and this is definitely not the pre-recording. Let's go to the qualifying. <laughs> yeah, here we go. Into Interlagos. Yep. We just, just suddenly changed our minds, we're not going to Alton Park. But mm. here we go, with qualifying. What? Yeah, basically said, we just changed our mind, we're going to the Lagos instead. But not really. Oh, yeah. I'm a little bit tired, so... Yeah. So good. <laughs> Straight from work to record. I have no idea how this will go because I had no chance to test the track. The only thing I... We have the first car going out of track. Still be all the way. In the Vauxhall. Yeah. I mean at least this should work better than... Uh, than... Kyle Ami in Formula E. Yeah. Anyway, of course, all the way ahead. I would say solid start to the season. Finished second in the sprint race at Brent Edge Indy. Yep, definitely. But <laughs> apart from that, he has one P12, one P20, and one retirement. So hopefully, he can improve even more and get his fade on. Yeah, let's see if he can do that. Or at this point, I would say he might not be one of the championship favorites. But let's see what this lap brings out. Yeah, of course, from this point anyone can still win the championship. Yeah, it's early, <laughs> early days and no Jesus. Yeah, no Jesus indeed. As he said, GP2, right, let's start with the first lap from Holloway. Heading into the first corner. Uh, I actually don't know where the sector splits are. So let's see. Heading through next section of corners to the longer straight. Twenty five point seven. Yeah. <coughs> we cannot say if it's quick or not quick because it's the first time, of course. Oh yeah, yeah. this doesn't work <laughs> at all. Yeah. <laughs> Great job, BDCC. What? There's no he's heading through that chicane, which could cause a bit of chaos if you saw the last few seasons. Oh no. I yeah. I have no energy for chaos. Please, cars <laughs> be clean. Yeah, maybe. 
everyone will behave in the races. Good. Let's see, all the way heading towards this right hander. Now heading towards the final corner. This had his first time. It's it is a 130.2. 3. Yeah, uh, Koenig is faster. Yeah. The Barros goes faster. Here comes fastest. the Barros. Gonzalez. And. Ooh, that's not a good lap. Fe one second off. Ouch. Seriously, second. Here comes Moratelli. Ooh. Nils on fastest by 4 tenths. Great lap. Here comes Igor Peter. Seventh. Andre Zazanov, the championship leader, 8th. Irene Carpenter, 10th. Jonathan Martins, 12th. Blake Moore, 4th. Mion FG, P6. Here, one of the veterans, Zachary Fitzwater, goes 2nd. Simon Mutka, 12th. Julian Armeda goes into P11. Brendan Jackson slots into P2. Bella will. Where can she? So to P14, here's Jafari Blackwood, P11, and James Sturt, P20. Yeah, that's the first laps completed. Yeah, we have and, uh, Nilsson fast. Yeah, Nilsson with a very good lap. Yeah, indeed. Of course, the person who will get pole. Of course, we get a point for pole. It's a very good thing, I guess. Yeah, it's one point for pole, isn't it? Or more? Yes. One. It's one point. Okay. Yep. I mean, don't know if that's going to help in the big picture that much, but... Yeah, point is the point. Uh, that's true. As Gonzalez gets into the Toyota garage. E. Well, currently the, the person who's in P11 in the championship is a provisional pole. Yeah, let's see who will get out first on the lap two. Looking at the time sheets, the gaps at least on the at the back are quite large. Yeah, indeed. Maybe they they had some slight mistakes or got held up. Yeah. yeah, still uh, lots of time to improve. To add, in terms of mistakes, qualifying mistake rate is not on here, because to save a little bit of time, I decided that I won't do it, because if you do the qualifying mistake rate, you need to actually make, make a grid separately for both of mm. the races, so, and I don't... I'm in a little bit of a tight spot with this recording, so I just decided that we we will try to do it as fast as possible. Yeah. So I can go to sleep. Yes, yeah, sleep is always important. Is yeah, here with Michael like, Arfield. Yeah, important sleep like those very great three hours I slept last night, so... Uh, Beric. This here is, of course, the car I think that won everything almost last season. Yeah, but with different driver, of course. And as this is an yeah. equal car series. We we'll never know. And yeah, of course, it doesn't have Jesus. Yeah. Instead, they have Arfield. 
<laughs> yeah, who will start the second qualifying lap right about now? Going to turn one. Oh, oh might be held up by the Ford. Traffic. Yeah, oh, he's overtaking yeah. the Ford. Maybe he doesn't lose yeah, that, that much. Wait, couldn't get to that was, I think that was Almeida. It was Almeida, I saw the text. Oh. Okay, let's see, first okay. sector, way down. Yeah. But maybe the second or third sector you could to get a bit of time out. Mm, but it doesn't seem to be very fast. Almeida's mm. still very close to him. Yeah, he's slower than the Ford behind. Ooh, that could also be a problem for Almeida in his lap. Oh, I think there was quite an error on the chicane, but I'm not sure. No, the cars are just but very twitchy around this track, it seems like the, the CC line well, is a little bit weird here. Well, look at this Almeida's attacking. Yeah, good. because attacking <laughs> is what you want to do in a qualifying session. <laughs> yeah, also the car behind those two is closing yeah, I up. I think all three of these are going to just have horrible laps. Yeah, but for Ben Jackson it's not that much of a drama because Speaking he's second Speaking of horrible at laps, 1.3 down for the Barros. Moratelli goes second. But Moratelli goes second. Yes, the German Marv König in the German car currently in P8. And we improve. No, Gonzalez goes to P3. He needed that lap. Yeah, he's needs on doesn't improve. Holloway. Ooh, second. Me too. Yeah, good job. Yes, Patrick Borgi. P20, Zazarov, the championship leader, doesn't improve. Blake, Blake Moore. Moore. P9. Peter, P10. Ten. Blackwood, whoa, Blackwood. that's a good lap. <laughs> yeah, wow. It was four tenths faster. 3.8 tenths, and into the top goes. Uh, uh, did I just forget his name? Blackwood? Yes, Blackwood. <laughs> yeah. As you can see, uh, yeah, the old old it. old man's dementia is striking here. Yeah, here's Armada, of course doesn't improve doesn't improve. Here comes Bruno the Bowers. Everybody's pitting now. Oh yeah. So yeah, after the second one, Blackwood did put out a stunning lap to go to the provisional pole. Yeah, let's see if anybody can match it though. Yeah, let's see, of course. But I think it's a very good lap. Yeah. Nothing to say, I guess, at the moment. Nope. Everybody's <laughs> just coming to the pits. Yeah. Of course, the gap between the top two and the championship is 12 points, but it can change dramatically over the course of this meeting. Yeah, it's only the third one. Like, I think if like people from like P16 or something like that can get right to the top if they just have a good, good meeting here. Meanwhile, as uh, Newaril goes out of the track with the Volvo racing Volvo, because you need yeah. to have the two Volvo Volvos in it. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't seem. <laughs> To be honest, it doesn't seem like look like a racing car. It just look like a normal 
road car for me. Yeah, I don't know how the hell is this box supposed to compete, but <laughs> I, I guess they have some secret technique to make the car faster. Yeah. Stillesley is also on track. Currently P10. And hopefully nobody will have big traffic. This Borg is on track. I would actually expect New World to have some traffic here. Usually yeah, well, the, the first car out on every run, run seems to be the one that gets the traffic. But yeah, let's yeah, see indeed. how the Volvo Volvo does. <laughs> Going through the final two corners. Heading towards the pit straight. Starting. And here we go. Let the number three. Has been started. Yeah. And uh, traffic? No traffic actually. The Ford is behind yeah. but... Yeah, this will be a clean lap for Newerville. Yeah, indeed. And the car in front, I think it's a Toyota. Far enough ahead. No problems there. And uh, four tenths. Let's see where is he in the standings. This could be an improvement. Yeah, maybe. As we get to the chicken. And it takes chicken. it nicely. Yeah, yeah, the chicken. Something I will eat. <laughs> we're going to the next chicken. Yeah, the second chicken. I'm just going to say chicken. The chicken so yeah. got old already. Yeah. And uh, one second, and it's could it's still be an improvement. A small one, maybe, but not the best of laps here. And into the final corner we get. I just noticed that Newell has number 69. Nice. Nice. And hey. no. <laughs> Basically did the same lap as the previous. Oh. Oh no. Oh, what happened here with the powers? No, no, no. Uh, oh. What? No, he... Just ran out of road. Oh dear. <laughs> what is this? This is... Yeah, with who? It was a Toyota, it's I think. Yeah. It's a normal error, and the mistake rate is norm. It it's not increased. It's the normal mistake rate. So this is extremely rare to happen. But yeah, the Barros spins on his lap while trying to get past the Toyota. But now the problem is, will he be stuck? Or will he get away yeah, with it? Yeah, these cars just get stuck. Ah. That's Most that's of the shame. time. I could fix it, but I guess this is just BTCC. Okay, let's... Who is getting into the line? Uh, Tidusley, cross 9th. Come on. Okay, yeah, he has... And... Is Patrick Borgi. Currently in last. He needs an improvement. In the Nissan. Yeah, heading a, towards. A car my friend line. had and, and. Two seconds he, off. Yeah. Wow. It's very slow. Off here 18. Jen Jackson starts his lap. But yeah, so. All the way. So, fun fact uh, my friend, one of my friend, uh, had an Primera as his uh, everyday car and. He suddenly didn't get use it. I asked what happened and he said I parted it to the shit. So basically <laughs> he he parted it in the car and de destroyed it. Hello. <laughs> so we had a few improvements, that's enough improved. Our radar got seventeenth, FG improved, stirred I think. Also Koenig. Yeah, lots of, lots of smaller improvements happening here. 
Yes, he has the yellow Renault. Yeah, way off. Two seconds. Mulka doesn't improve. This is yeah, and he has. Wait, here's the Pachos. He did get go again. Yeah, I got back on the uh, track, and I'm thinking if I actually did increase that. Not, not the mistake of 63 <laughs> seconds off. <laughs> <laughs> Over one minute and, off. And here's Holy Carpenter. Moly. And. Uh, oh. Ooh. I mean. Oh! Why? It's crash! To, to this, I would, ask, I would say. Why the hell do we use tracks like this? Yeah, because it's British. It's because it's. British Story Card Championship. I'm going to just check one thing. That was a uh, big uh, crash in qualifying. Yeah, this is going to happen like seven times in the race. I can just feel it already. Yeah. Hmm. I think we can prepare the count already. I mean... Hopefully... We could avoid it, but mm, let's see. I mean, for the feature race, I could um, edit the track settings a little bit. I did apply the the um, weight pads to these cars, but of course, if the track settings are f bad, then it doesn't do much. Of course, that looked like it's just the track being bad itself and not the setting so but let's see if it if things get too bad I will just check if I can if I can <laughs> rectify the issue but yeah let's see I mean yes, we have ten. you're gone I was just saying that I mean the weight patch is something that managed to fix Hungary turn 3. So it's pretty powerful to be honest. Yeah, of course when you're watching this the Hungarian GP already happened. We, of course we're recording this on in February. February I just realized that and it will be really embarrassing if the Hungarian GP is going <laughs> it's, a, it's a pancake. <laughs> that I, that will be embarrassing, but like, I mean, if it rains, then it's acceptable. Like, then that's just nothing will fix that. And uh, rain is rain. Rain can be chaotic. I will not care. But like, if it's a dry race and turn three is shit again, and <laughs> I, I'm saying these things in this uh, pre-recorded stream. Yeah, I'll, I'll be looking like a clown. Clown circus. <laughs> and yeah, let's, bro, let's, just, like let's just add bosses primitive at the level of children into the mix. Yeah, see if Tildesley salting his next lap. The Ford. Yep. For, for, for letters in soft cover. <laughs> Is a Finnish saying of oh. this car maker. It's funny. Tillisley isn't far off. And uh, yes. oh, we have a yellow flag, or is it the old one? Ah, uh, this is a new one. This is Borg. Oh, it's Borgy. From the. It's the sa oh, yeah, no. same. No, yeah, that... yeah, what happens here is like, when they get overtaken, the second go, uh, this is, l this is almost carbon copy of what happens with Montreal, with Ooh, the Montreal yeah. chicane, where when you, when the car gets overtaken, he will avoid to off the racing line and then bounce back to the track. And hit the other car. Like this is yeah. it's it's bad track design, in my opinion. Like 
obviously it could be that it's difficult to difficult to do to make that work but I mean I think at this rate I it could be better to to not use the GK inversion if this is how the racing will be in ar in around 10 minutes when we are doing the race I'm very nervous for that like we are going to have like three cars finishing it Ooh, oh, oh, for fuck's sake. Uh, it's ah, no, for no, it's oh, what's happened again? It will end. Was it? Oh, yeah. Salonov, the championship leader. At least no damage. Yeah, this is this is not looking good at all. And if it, if it happens in qualifying three times, then oh, dear. That is not looking good at seriously. Comes across the line, doesn't improve actually, and he has a checkered flag, so his qualifying session is over. Is and uh, what's, uh, what's more worrying is that it's been every single overtaking attempt at that corner, which probably means that the corner itself is fucked. And I just realized that I've completely demonetized this video now. It's not like we are making money with this anyway, so... No, but still... It's a, it's a fun joke. <laughs> it's funny all the time, is it? It doesn't improve, also his qualifying session is done. Here comes Michael Arfield. Powering across the line. And he doesn't improve over two seconds off. Yeah. Koenig doesn't improve. Here comes Mio and FG. Swedish guy, yeah, he doesn't improve as well. Swedish man in the Swedish car. Yeah, it's, it's fitting quite well, I think. See, it's Jafari Backward, current post sitter. Doesn't need to improve. Neos doesn't. Way was way off. Is Borgi. Can he go out of last place? Yes, but only 21st. And now it's uh, Martins in the last place. Yeah. As here comes Peter. Doesn't improve. Mutka, corner. Doesn't improve. And uh, repeating. More. Mutka with one, with one T only though. Means corner in Finnish. Oh. <laughs> And Martins improves and Borgi is last again. Yeah, that's a, sh that's a shame for the Italian. He's Bruno the Powers, doesn't improve. Carpenter goes ninth. He's Zalanov. Ka Ewan Carpenter, the man that sounds like an Indy car driver. Yeah. I think that's it for some of you, of course, have a few guys left with at least one lap. Yeah, uh, Brandon Jackson, one, Zach two, Fitzwater. Four cars will. James Sturt and Bella Nova will. These four guys still have one lap to go. Yep. To and prove the position. And those cars will definitely get. Out again. Yeah. And here's Gonzalez pitting and taking a break. Yeah, but not that long break because the sprint race just around the corner. And I can hear myself twice. And here's Jackson. Yeah. yeah. So far, Jackson. The last in the standings. 
zero points. Also Fitzwater and Gonzalez doesn't didn't score points so far. Yeah, I can hear myself in the background. When you talk? Yes. I think now it's gone. It's now gone. Yes. Okay. Jackson going underneath the Honda sign. Which is quite funny because we don't have Honda here at BTC. <laughs> There's another one. Jackson now heading towards the start finish line to start his final lap of the session. He goes. Heading towards turn one. Heading towards turn two. Actually, don't know how many corners are there on the track. I don't even know this track. <laughs> so uh... I'm not surprised. <laughs> to be honest, this is Jackson. The only oh. one tenth down. I mean, this lap might even be good enough for second place if he gets second sector correctly. Yeah. He comes out of that corner section, heading towards the problematic chicane. The chicane of terror. Moving steady. Yeah. <laughs> And let's see. 293. Could still be on for the front row, but let's see. This, of course, one sector to go. One sector that doesn't even have that many corners. Heading towards the penultimate corner. Now to the final corner. And Brendan Jackson comes across the line to and go P4. into P4. He lost time in the final sector. Still a good lap. Yeah. We well, we now in the Volvo. Volvo. Making <laughs> towards this corner. This lap is going to be a huge improve for himself, but probably not going to get that far up the order. Now where this this lap plays no will the cross line now. Doesn't improve at all, what? Wow. It was a horrible last sector. Here's like we fits water with the, the here's with the first who is sector. definitely the oldest driver on the grid. Without a doubt. I'm still wondering what is he doing? He is still in BTCC. He used to I mean, be in F1. Yeah. But it's his decisions, oh yeah. <laughs> no problem. So he's still up. Quite a bit, I think. We also cannot see the sectors it's with the personal sector, best sector, so... Yeah, and uh, yeah, there's no panel, so it's going to be a little bit. Wait, uh, does he go? He doesn't... Oh, he lost... Oh dear, he lost so much time, and that's of course qualifying over, and that means Jafari Blackwood is on pole position. Again, I think. Wait. No, it's his first pole. Of course, he will get the bonus point. Wait. Yeah, that's the result. So, Javari Blackwood is on pole. Emil Nielsen is in P2. 
Joby Holloway's in third. Brandon Jackson, who started in P4. Caio Moratelli, who's in P5. Ahead of Rubino Gonzalez. Andre Sasanov, the championship leaders in P7. Ahead of Marvel König. Erwin Carpenters in P9. Simon Mutka in P10. And Zachary Fitzwaters in P11. Uh, Jake Tildesley, P12. Bruno de Bavos, 13th. Eagle Peter, 14th. Mivan Evci, 15th. James Stewart, 16th. Blake Moore, 17th. Julian Almeida, 18th. Jonathan Martins, 19th. Michael Overfield, 28th. Uh, what the hell? Uh, <laughs> Bella Neuerwil, 21st. And Patrick Berge in 22nd. And with this, we will go st- straight to the race. Uh, that sprint race, of course. Yeah, I don't think we need to read out yeah, the grid again. Yeah, we, we can just go through it. No, no need for that. I'm just yeah. going to press OK and oh no. Oh god. Th- what, where, where is this from rain. the top class? Yeah, we should have, have, have that in Silverstone, not here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, of course, the top class. We don't know if it's raining in the race in Hungary. Uh, I'm personally hoping not. Yeah, when this has yeah. been recorded, the rain has been avoiding the F1 tier for the whole season. But yeah, yeah. let's see how this the goes. Race. Yeah, here we go with the sprint race. What, what could that... possibly go wrong? Yeah, let's see. Oh, By the way, we didn't see. saw the rain for later, so yeah, Joe made it that, that the rain, f- it was at, I think, 60 minutes was based for the feature race, but here, five lights are on. And here we go, it's racing. I think Blackwood got quite a good start. Look at Holloway coming to the third. Blackwood heading to the first corner first. I think it was clean, the clean start. I think. They are clean turn one, definitely. Now they are fighting. Blackwood keeps the lead. Who? And uh, we are going think to. Think more lost. Few places going to the second corner. Rick was trying to build a gap in the lead. It's Jackson in third. It was in fourth. It's Gonzalez, the needs on. Let's see the chicane. Ooh, looks clean at the moment. Well, uh, clean, but like the cars are just twitching around. Yeah, it's like driving on ice. This FG. Ah, it's, it's, a bit it's, of a it's like it's like driving on a glitch, white. and then oh, that yellow flag. Uh, where Something is happened. It's uh, oh, Mor- Mor- Moratelli. Where's Moratelli? And there's Jackson. Wait, no, no, we need some. Wait, What's they are outside. Here? They are not on the track. What? We we need to take a replay of that. Yeah, here's the replay. Was and they hit each other and then the cars disappear. Uh, it, yeah. And then That's the big. cars re- <laughs> Bermuda's triangle, is that you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The cars are completely gone. But not raw gone. 
Das König setzt sofort Slap. And Moratelli is out. Moratelli is out. Uh, Nilsson, Nilsson is uh, there, but I guess he will be out too. And yeah, yeah, this is, I can, I can already see this race going downhill. Yeah. Carpenter now up to sixth place. And here's the old drivers. Fitzwater and the Burrows. Not sure, but I think Nilsson got on track again. Uh, it, uh, kind of. He got visible again. He is trying. Yeah, he <laughs> it's goes. difficult, but he's not. He, he yeah. did it. And there he goes. He's seriously attacking. And this is going to be a crash. Gonzalez. No, actually. no, it wasn't. Maybe in the rain or in races with heavier fuel, that could be better than the qualifying. Uh, it, it makes sense, but I think it's going to be this corner that's an issue. Yeah, there's yep. a spinning he forward. This thing goes off. Wait, how did he go off? He, he makes... Oh, he just ah... Outbreaked himself. God damn it with the person who made this. Yeah. As we see everybody else going through. Jackson comes there. I I do I do wish I could uh, fix something like that, but I am honestly I do not believe I can fix that. I can for the yeah, future, I will going. I will try to change the settings a little bit, but uh, don't don't put the hopes up. Yeah, with Mutka attacking carpet, I think. Yeah, <laughs> look at that, everyone, apart from Blackwood, of course. Yeah. Take this because everybody who's DMP fighting for one. position is going to crash. Yeah. The, what, what means if you don't fighting, you should probably escape without any problems. But yeah, don't see that happen. There's of course a huge gap between the guys in P3 and P4. And here's a battle for oh, the oh, battle what? For Holloway tried to run the outside. It was here. clean. It didn't work. And but now, now going. he's there. And we have to. Well, we haven't survived because now Mutka is absolutely oh. destroyed. No, that's Gonzalez. Oh, oh, that's a big accident. Gonzalez is, of course, out. Yeah, yeah the whole car oh. has exploded. Yeah, and it's, of course, yeah. Oh, <laughs> look how he's flown into the air. That's a huge wreck. My um, goodness. I don't think you would in real life survive that without injuries. Yeah. I mean, just Is there lo an onboard look view? at how look at how Gonzalez just flies and the car gets destroyed. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Did Mutka survive? <laughs> so Mutka survived somewhat. And yeah, Gons. Yeah, he's definitely. Oh, that's no question. Now uh, here's another replay. Yeah, look at him flying through the air. Yeah, sadly, this is. It's only lap three, and like every time they go into this corner, they will just crash. So yeah, well, he did, didn't want to get damage, but because there was a lot of debris flying. 
I don't think anybody got damaged by the debris. Okay, that's good. So sadly, I do expect uh, the Blackwood and Holloway fight to end in a crush as well, as with all of the other fights that are going on. Here's the power of attacking Peter. Cause the Baros, I think the only guy in OC history to race in all five tiers at some stage of his career. Has he raced in Formula E? Yes, 2016 for two races. Oh. Yeah. Then moved to DTM and got replaced by yours truly, the graph mover. Wait. Holloway has lost 2.5 seconds. Did he maybe made a slight mistake? Yeah, either that or tried to move and it failed. Uh, Mutka is still stuck there, but... And it's <laughs> even no yellow flag. Yeah. I mean, of course the cars disappeared. Yeah, that's, that's true. And now we get on overtake. Peter overtakes Fitz, whatever. Yep, for P5. It's the Australian. And uh, now the yellow flag has appeared for Mutka. Yeah. Took a while. Yeah, but yeah, of course now he's a lap down. Which is a shame. I'm not sure if he's going to get back to that track. Yeah, it's also another question, of course. Well, actually he might, because he, yeah, he's back on the track, but way down. Yeah. So, he could also park the car and wait for the feature is Makes no sense. But, yeah, well, I guess he could he try learning the, the track. Oh, yeah. That's, that's a good point. Yeah, there he is, uh, going to the yeah, pit pretty wildly. Yeah, that's... Uh, to be honest, I'm a bit surprised that the chicane, nothing happened and, yet. Uh, and that's Feedswater oh, who's had... Feedswater's had a car failure. And uh, oh dear. I guess uh, oh, some people out. call this man the unluckiest driver in the TP for OC. Yeah. <laughs> of course, in the chat, then we will see maybe someone else who thinks that someone else is even more unlucky. But let's see what the failure it was. Carpenter's and Peters in the front slap. Doesn't know. So many faster. Uh, uh, it's a puncture. Puncture. Oh, come on. So, yeah. I thought rain tires were even more durable than normal dry tires. And not for feet, whatever. Yeah, the same, really. Meanwhile, I've got a confirmation that my Alfa Romeo hoodie is arriving in a week or two. That's nice. Of course, Fitzwater will remain with zero points. After five rounds, which is absolutely cutting for him, there's still a lot to go. And Mutka so far behind it didn't even pass Fitzwater yet. Yeah, Moot guy is just driving around at this point. And, yep. But these two are not driving around the Sassanova and the Barrows are fighting for position and uh, do, don't crash, please. Yeah, they don't crash, that's good. There's enough in the Peugeot. Here goes the Peugeot. And gets the move done cleanly. Good job. Yeah, but I think this this corner here doesn't make any problems, but the 
corner before that is absolutely chaotic, yeah. especially in these conditions. He's third. We're currently P9. There's a gap between Holloway and Blackwood. Is eight tenths. No, eight tenths of seconds. As he comes third. Oh, nice Close move. Two. Yeah, in that place, it's a very good move indeed. Is the leader to fight Blackwood. Holloway still trying to get him. It didn't he lose a f two seconds at one point? Yeah, he's definitely faster. Oh, he's yeah, and he might be yeah. able to do it now. Yeah, now down the inside goes. Holloway, you have no layer of flag. Now it's at the chicane. And yeah, it's oh, the real and yeah. bulky. Oh. And it is the. Yeah, it's this. And new will oh. loses uh, something from his car. I have no idea what it is. It looks like it's a copy of the actual car, but yeah. <laughs> it's gone and. It like and does this mean that. It's all this goddamn damages. And uh, a new rule seems to not even need the pit because of that. Really? I have doubts on that, I think. Okay, definitely has to be look at the pace. Yeah. But yeah, and Blackfoot. for the lead. Blackfoot. We missed Blackfoot. Would get in the place back after here. Oh yeah. yeah. What happened here? I just I think he just we overtook. Holloway makes a weird Holloway movement around. Look. Oh. Holloway completely yeah, no, ruins his own exit from the corner, and Blackwood leads. Yeah. It's <laughs> absolutely. Not good at all. The driving has the driving standards have gone out of the window today. Yeah. <laughs> but even the, like even the leaders are doing stuff like this. It could also mean that the track this driving stretches indeed. Oh. Or the cars don't have much grip. Well, yeah, they definitely don't have much creep, but... Okay, let's, let's, see, let's, let's see if Holloway can Holloway. actually do it cleanly. Which I do kind of doubt. Ooh, not here. Yeah, it doesn't do it there. It's which back is off. Yeah, that, yeah, that's smart. And now, now into here. Oh no, he's going to lock up. Oh no. That uh, doesn't... I was Ooh. sure he was going to slide into Blackwood there. Oh, lucky escape. Look at the cards are sliding. And then manages yeah. to just save was it. Are you looking at... Look and at Holloway's that sky. Holloway's done the same thing again. Oh. And now. Yeah, no. Koenig is there now. Yeah. And also Mutka, but it's two laps down. And Salsen offset the fastest lap. By the way, I think that Blackboard still had every lap so far. Yep, I do. I do think that is the case. Because. Holloway hasn't actually managed to overtake for longer than a corner. Carpenter got past. You can see it on the bottom of the screen. Yep. And uh, 
Mutka is definitely faster than the two in the front. Of course, way yes, down. And okay. Ooh, just, uh, Interesting dude. movements there. Chasing. I would recommend these two to go Ulos. <laughs> yeah, Ulos indeed. And here's a three way battle for P4. Satchanov, Peter, and Carpenter. So it was Peter who passed Carpenter, <laughs> I think. And there's a car. Oh, don't, don't tell me. It's Koenig! Koenig and, and Holloway. Holloway! And that's oh, Blackwood Black winning the race. Because of this. What? What was Holloway doing? He just pushed Koenig onto the grass. Yes, oh. There was... I think both cars didn't get any damage. Yeah, there was no damage, but the other than losing all of the positions, the track issues have hit again. Yeah. No, no, Blackwood has a huge gap. Perkele. Yeah, Perkele indeed. Martins now from the back. It's now P9. And what, what I just noticed, the top two in the championship and the top two in the race. It's also not happened to P2. Zazunov. It's not Zazanov. Zazanov is how I pronounce it. Yeah. It's probably wrong, but that's how I pronounce it. Yeah, I think it's right. <laughs> I thought I saw, said his name wrong, but it was right. But yeah. Move on with the two Renos. I think Holloway and Gurdick are still stuck there. Yeah, the bottle track it really looks like they go off the track. Which definitely reminds me of Ra in the concept series. Is Martins trying to stay close to the back of his teammate? And now both are one lap down. Yeah, now not too much is happening because of every car that has been fighting on the track are in the gravel traps. Yeah, now the yellow flags appeared again. <laughs> it's st still six laps to go. Yeah, I think now it's time to look at the top ten of this race. Because so many things happen, so many guys dropping out of the top 10 because of crashing and <laughs> look at that we've got 202 seconds behind yeah and here's the order Blackwood leads out of his championship rival Zalanov Peter is in third out of Carpenter as new will set the first lap the Bowers is in P5, in the far field. Blake Moore is in P7, James Sturt in 8, Jonathan Smart is in 9, and Armada completes the points at the moment. Here's Holloway. And look at this little battle here. Mutka <laughs> trying to unlap himself. And with that, uh, probably has a better tires for the conditions. Yeah. And I think the conditions are improving. I guess. They are. So we have five laps to go. And here Sasanov and Peter. The two Russians. Peter goes for the move. And he goes through. 
and Holloway is trying <laughs> to get out of the gravel. Confused in the wiki says Peter's Brazilian. I question he is. Yeah, I thought he's Russian. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, anyway. New level sets the fastest lap. Again. which will be interesting in the feature race is because the strategy will come into play as if we have an attack from Jackson but didn't work and we have another yellow flag yeah. And it's uh, more it and the Holloway. More. Well, more is Wait. new, but. What happened to more? Uh, what is going. Um, more just, he just spins spun on, his on his own. own and oh, then and he gets hit by yeah. the Renault. By, so, by yeah, this is, uh, this is just a regular driver error. Yeah, he yeah, just. Finally, a regular error. And because there's been so many crashes, the cars don't have a damage physics anymore. <laughs> but yeah, yeah. bad mistake what from Blake Moore, who's lost the point, lost points, and lost the sprint race, starting grid position as well. And yeah, yeah Holloway has been Always like this hit. for a long time. And look at that outfit got gained 14 places from yeah, 20 to P6. I'm, I'm going to say it's not that impressive considering what the track is like. Yeah. Yeah, indeed. So you just need to stay out of trouble and points are almost safe. At this rate. Me and Almeida, I think it got past Martins, unseen by the cameras. Yeah, he is uh, Argentinian. We're now heading to the closing stages of this sprint race, of course, which was very, very, very chaotic as we have three laps to go. Yep. And Holo is still there. I am, I'm here. Uh, there's just not that much going on on the race. Only two laps remaining. Mm. 
Yeah, all cool. of the all of the cars have been separated. Separated a lot because of the issues with the track. Well, uh, Almeida and Martins are quite close together, but the rest. You're still there. <coughs> Dennis. Wait. Check. Okay, now, now I can hear you. Okay. Yeah, we got a little bit of a battle for the last laps. Now. Yeah. As uh, Martins gets the move done and now it's all made until the slave fighting. And also one thing, if Blackwood wins it would be his third straight victory in the uh, third victory in succession of those yeah. two wins at Brands Hedge Indy. Yeah. This time I have to say he wasn't the fastest car, but he <laughs> he had some luck. <laughs> Yeah, it, he it fits not the fastest car wins, wins, but the smartest guy wins. The car that avoids the box. Yeah, <coughs> indeed. He was all the way st stuck at that oh corner. No. Did he find it good? Oh, the cat, uh, oh. The Okay, they survived, which is good, until the slave probably got a speed boost out of that. Yeah. Yeah, Tildesley, of course, was also involved in one of that incidents, but yeah. he's not back in, As we are in the, final the final lap. lap. So, going to Blackwood, who's lost a lot of time to be there. Yeah, but I think he will bring it home. This Tildes League got past Armada. So it was really a speed boost. Yep, and the track is actually getting dry at the last lap, funnily enough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at the gap, it's only one second. It could I think be close in the end here. Peter would have needed one more lap to be sure of the move but if he wants to try an aggressive one he could yeah, because it looks like Blackwood happen. has been struggling a lot on the last laps yep indeed no uh, again with the fastest lap look he's right behind him oh it's going to be could actually make a move. it could happen here on the final lap oh don't look crash at that. you two Oh, that would be even more drama. Maybe heading towards the penultimate corner. There's already a green flag, man. Oh, he's trying for and it, but he... it's just not enough. Yeah. And Blackwood stays ahead. Will he? He's, he's weaved. Oh, it's going to be close. It's going to be very close. Whoa. Peter wins. Peter wins. I what? cannot zero believe it! 0.003! <laughs> well, I've never seen anything like it. Uh, it, it, mu it must be the. Like, there's been. Uh, everybody in the main. Like, in the F1 remembers Korea 2013. But that was. Uh, I think that was closer. I think Korea 2013 between Nell and Volker was. I think. Uh, I think half a tenth. Now it was three thousands. Well, that that was right on the line. We we yeah. will take a replay of that right after the cars get through the line. That oh my that was insane. Me. Yeah, never seen anything like it. Stealing the victory on the line. She's he's in sixteen. Heading towards the finish. What oh, an incredible 
Ma must hurt Good Blackwood, it. that one. Yeah, indeed. He is all the way, actually. <laughs> Finally getting to the line. And Mutka also. It is Mutka. Okay, so now... Let's look at that incredible finish. <laughs> he is so the, they, the eco they, He tries to move to the final corner. Doesn't get it. But uh, Blackwood... Just Makes a weird, takes a weird line there, and that gives him the chance to to get more more speed into the line. And look at how close this is. Yeah, it's like a photo finish. Yeah, look. Yeah, it is a photo finish. Right there. <laughs> Just zero point zero zero three seconds. Whoa, oh my goodness. I still cannot believe this. Yeah, it's uh I didn't expect that to happen. Yeah. It was one of the craziest BTCC races ever. Peter so yeah, the in the, win. so first the lap start, of course, Blackwood gets the most laps led. Points, he led every yep. single lap apart from the last one. Yeah, that also means that Peter will get an extra point for leading a lap. So yeah. Here are the results, so Eco Peter just stealing the win at the finish line, winning with the undoubtedly closest I mean, it, it, ca it cannot get closer than that, like a 0 0.001 maybe, but how, how can you do that then? Yeah, and so far Blackwood finishes in second, Andreas Arsenov is in third. To be the final guy on the podium, Aaron Carpenter is in fourth, Bruno de Bowers finishes in fifth, Michael Arfield, good race from here in P6, James Stewart seventh, Jonathan Martins in eighth, Julian Almeida in P9, Jake Tiddes in tenth, to complete the points, and Brandon Jackson is in P11. And Miran Evci, twelfth, Borki thirteenth, Moore fourteenth, Newabril fifteenth, Nilsson sixteenth, Koenig seventeenth, Mutka eighteenth, Holloway nineteenth, Fitzwater Punxer, Gonzalez Crust, Moratelli Crust. And, yeah, and Holloway was so far off that he wasn't even classified. Yeah, I, he, he was on the track, but yeah, he didn't get classified. And uh, the fastest lap goes to Bella Neuvavilla. With no the, surprise. With the freshest yeah, tires no, on the, the gap. track. <laughs> Easily. So now... Yeah. I will pause the recording, uh, do the grid for the for the feature race, and see you in that very shortly. Yes. Um, welcome back. Uh, we are in here in the feature race. We have the grid that's based on the results of the sprint race. The uh, <laughs> sprint race for. For this one was quite something, but yeah, Dennis yeah, is here indeed. as well. Terrible. And uh, I'm going to do the first half of the grid this time. Yes. So, Igor Peter on pole position, Jafari Blackwood second, Andrei Sassanov third, Ion Carpenter fourth, Bruno de Barros fifth, Michael Arfield sixth, James Sturt seventh, Jonathan Martins eighth, Julian Almeida 9th, Jake Tildesley 10th, Brandon Jackson 11th, and um, Miran Evci P12. And you go from the... Yeah. yeah, here comes the graph remover. In P13 we have Patrick Borghi, the Italian. In P14 is Blake Moore. 
from P15 starting is Belanurville, who has had the fastest lap in the sprint race. In P16 is Emil Nilsson, who has the car pointing in the other direction of the others. P17 is Paolo like Pöli. Yeah, <laughs> he definitely won't start like that, that's for sure. Simon Mutka is in P18. Toby Holloway will start from P19. Zachary Fritzwater after his puncture. Hopefully, we'll have a better future race. We'll start from 20th. And in the back of the grid, we have Rubinho Gonzalez and Caio Moratelli. And now we have no rain. complete dry race. And it's going to give me, personally, a good contrast to see how chaotic the track is at wet and how chaotic it is at dry. Because in dry, I do expect the chicane to be a little bit troublesome. I did change some setuping of the track a little bit. Too. Let's, so let's see what happens. Let's just, let's just start the race, goddammit. Yeah. Here at Interlagos. Yeah, the British Interlagos. And here, here we are on the grid. Here's Peter, of course, snatched the win from Blackwood at the line. <laughs> the right right in the line. Yeah, in the line, as we have five flights on. And the feet race is on the way. Good start for Peter. Seems like good start for... Yeah, good, A little bit great start for Blackwood. Peter. But Blackwood keeps the second place, I think. Yeah, definitely keeps it. Or maybe he will... Yeah, he's going to lose around the outside to Sassanov. And now it's yep. Sassanov in P2 and already going for the lead. Don't do it there. It, Thank you. It's very aggressive. And there's a little bump. <laughs> Two bumps, three bumps, uh, lots of bumps, and Few there's bumps. Nilsson. The crash. And Borgi it's is Borgie. out of the race, and what's happened here, and... Ooh, oh, the free the, ride, uh, oh. The ripple impact. Oh. And Borgi has <laughs> his car absolutely destroyed by that. And that was Nuovil, who was... Well, let's see, it's the... I think the it's the Volvo goes to the inside, and yeah, three cars do not fit there. Yep. I think, yeah, Borgi was an innocent bystander in this. Also, the yep. uh, Nilsson, of course, spins in that as well. And the guy who caused it <laughs> is just driving around like nothing happened. <laughs> yeah. And now we're co coming towards the chicane. We have Peter defending. Ah, no! He comes out of the and contact! They are out oh. of the race and. Uh, Peter's definitely out. Yeah, oh. Peter is out and. We will emerge in the lead. And Bruno de Burrows has sneaked Bruno himself. De lead. He's stolen the lead in the craziness that was that. And yeah, the. The track just doesn't work as intended. Anyway, the winner of the sprint race is out, out because of this. Yeah, he's Ulos. Yeah, he's Ulos. And Satsun. <sighs> Locking yeah. the track. I, For I, everybody. I don't know what, what should I even say to this. And yeah, here's Blackwood doing things. Yeah. Here comes Carpet though. Uh, he's. Uh, is he already ahead? Sparrow sets the fastest lap, of course. He's a and I hope the And I hope the rest of the race is clean. So let's see. Big yeah, let's FG and more have been the biggest gainers of lap one. <laughs> Both Se games six places. Yeah. Of course, they probably had a way to sneak past during the uh, roadblock. Yeah. <laughs> and 
Yeah, it sounds a lot of surprisingly didn't get any damage in that contact. More but bombs. There was almost damage. Yeah. I thought I would see Debbie flying, but th that was the big board. Ooh. And yeah, here's, oh, and here's the here, next one. Here's the next one, oh. Yeah, it's going to happen every one lap. Holloway. Yeah. Mutka and Holloway both are out. To be called. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not even surprised anymore. And there's uh, it's this place as well. Oh, another one, Martins, and who's that? Yeah, it's the it's the same thing happens in the dry too. And I'm and I just I don't disappeared. I don't understand this track. I seriously don't understand yeah, I think, this track. <laughs> I think this layout won't be used again. PCC. Here we have Nilsson attacking Jackson. Well, Martins will probably get back on the track in some laps. Yeah, in some laps, <laughs> indeed. We have already five retirements. And I think there's more to come, to be honest. Can't wait. Uh, here's Martins. With the I think, look yeah, at the Renault sandwich. engine. Renault accident management. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there was the leader, Bruno de Barros. Quite a big lead, of right. course. Oh, it's close. Interesting move. Team Louisville, start. And there's the uh, window of Martins still stuck. Yep. He is. There was the onboard view of Jackson. And uh, uh, the Volvo oh. is off for a moment. Yeah, what happened here? You think he just got pushed no. out? Yeah, yeah he... he... Another issue of the truck? Yeah. Or like... Or the AI? I don't yeah, really understand what's happening anymore. Yeah, this track is completely weird. Not just in the wet, but also the dry. I miss Brand Hatch Indy. That track worked yeah. well. Yeah, it was, of course, short. So there were no... There wasn't any room for big bucks, I think. Martins comes and <laughs> finally escaped off the off the gravel and into the pits. Here's Sazarov. Who gained massively with the bowers. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. both us going on um, the grass. Okay, come oh, on, get to the track. Come on, do do it no Oh no. And if it's water, it's whatever more. is uh, Again in the mud. He's not out. Yeah. Again, he looks like he will stay on zero points, but still, not long race. Many things can and probably will happen. And there's. I'm sure I saw something. I guess my eyes were wrong there, but I thought I saw flying cars. <laughs> Well, we probably will see flying cars soon because Satsanov has caught Fitz, not Fitz for the, the Barros. The old guys getting yeah. mixed up. 
Yeah. <laughs> Both old. And yeah. The very experienced, of course. Oh no, 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 not there! Don't overtake the there! No! 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 Oh, and the bubbles is out! Perkele! Oh. oh god! Yeah, Perkele indeed! Carpet and up in the second, Zazan of Leeds, FG up in the fourth. Four yeah, fifth. sorry for everybody who's particip participating into this race, like, it's not fair. It's not fair at all. Yeah, not yeah, not really. Like the tra yeah, the, the track is not really. We shouldn't race on tracks like this. Yeah, as I said, it probably will be the last meeting on this layout. Of course, later this season we have the layout without chicanes, which would have been, I think, a better option this time. With more attacking. I do wonder if this layout was used before. I think it was. Let me check. So we have almost three right. Moment again with FG, more on and uh, Tildesley. If more did this is side by side. Ooh, that... Yeah. They're still very close. And finally, nothing happened that that chicane. Yeah, because nobody's... Well, apart from those, nobody else was close enough there. Yeah. And here, here comes more on Tildesloo. And he's through. Up into B4. I mean, the yeah. fighting is good apart from the chicane and the other place where they keep crashing. Yeah, indeed. It's just also we, this layout we used last season. Did last season's race have lots of DNFs? And we see. I think, yes, even Jesus retired twice. Especially in the feature, feature race. We had lots of retirements last season. How many? Uh, counted. Nine. Nine? Yes. I mean, that's... Uh, <laughs> Far back. So, somehow I'm surprised by how low the number is considering what the track is trying to do to the cars at the moment. Yeah, indeed. Anyway, this is becoming... Six or seven here. This is becoming a massive train. Yeah, but leading the train. Ooh, we still side by side. And the uh, FG is Ooh, off. Oh, lift is off. Oh. And uh, could it? Yep, <laughs> it is another cross between two Love AI you. cars. Oh, at least not track related. I guess. I don't know. Look at this, Koenig up into P8. 
when did he start? I think P17. So FG rejoins P15. Automatic camera for the moment. Yep, it's off here. Currently running in P. What was it? P6? No, 7. I'm not sure. Wait, it's P8. Koenig passed him. He's Come carpenter. Let's, let's have a little bit better view. Yeah, he's Blackwood. Defending from Carpenter. Successfully defending. Well done. Yeah, well, well done, done indeed. See, Carpenter Car too. Carpenter up into second place. But Blackwood tries to retake the place. And successfully and does so. He's done it. Yeah. It's a nice move. On the Jamaican driver. For but that now he has to do it all over again. And the two continuing the battle. So we are on lap nine. I wonder when will the first guy come into the pits? Oops. No, I let, let oh. me press this button. Fourteen. Fourteen laps. Eleven laps are gonna so, so it's like ele eleven to fifteen uh, laps for most of these as here so Carpenter Blackwood fight could again. Be lap eighteen. And Carpenter for the second time. Two laps. Wait. For the second time, this lap takes second. And Blackwood is back. Blackwood again. Yeah. Again. It's a great battle, I guess. Hmm, I'm surprised that this layout has been used. In every season of PTCC so far. But yeah, Capita has to do it again, and again. That's what I tell you, said of its water. <laughs> the Battle of P12. And they have hit each other, and the oh. Blackwood is not oh. out. But yeah, oh, that's, I mean, that's uh, this surprise. is what explains that uh, the retirement are in the nine or something like that. It's because the cars stop taking damage after a while. Hmm. Like at one, at some it point, they can. They can just fly into the walls at a million miles an hour and they will not get any damage. Hmm. He is seriously defending for more. Also behind them is... The Toyota, as he comes more. Oh, that's an interesting line from Tilsley. Yeah. Got what? <laughs> Gone <laughs> wide. And lost the place. Oh, so Tsatsanov Sat has 14 second lead. Wow. That's impressive. Because of things that happened. Yeah, it's too.
Uh, we come again in the chicane. Looking no crashes this list. time, but uh, he was going to. What is this line? Ooh. Stuart, Look come like on! Like he hit the wall. Yeah. It's all the officers do. Destroying everybody. Like Franco Lopez does in top class qualifying all the yeah. time. Apart from the times where he has weird incidents. Of course, like I said, in the I think qualifying was when you're seeing this, it, the Hungarian Compi has happened already. We are on Monday. Yeah. It's been on lap 12. Gonzalez attacking Tinsley for P5. This, we have a yellow flag. Now it's gone. I think Martelli had something. Stopped a few positions. Yeah, he spun. Not spun, he's been hit. Because uh, why not? Yeah. Yeah. Like FG a few laps ago. The yeah, hit continues. Here we have the battle for P4, I guess. You said even for P3. Wait, wait a second. What? More instead of Blackwood. Yeah, uh, he just overtook him. Oh, that's good for him. I didn't saw it. So more up into the podium places, it's Nielsen got past Fitzwater. Let's fight for P6. Yes, I'm going the German. Of course, took pole in the first. Qualifying, which was the only session in 2021. Yeah. It was the 2020 season. And, and here's a look up. Things happened. Kind of a look yeah. up. Anyway, let's let's let go to my camera. I have some honors here for a moment. Yeah. And here's Fitzwater defending from FG, I think. Yes, that's yep. FG. He is more quite fast, I guess. He is FG in P14 with the number 13. As he attacks Fitzwater here, doesn't work. He is Blake Morgan currently in podium places. Yeah, it shouldn't be too long until the pit stop starting. Yeah, uh, here's Sturt fighting uh, Neuerville, I think. It's one of the Volvo Volvos. Yes. I'm no now going to call the cars Volvo Volvos. <laughs> Volvo Volvo. <laughs> at, one point, at one point, I will really mess it up. <laughs> yeah, that will for certain have a place in those quotes when the race will get premiered.
Going through this again, looking all good here. I think he's going to try the move here or definitely will try something weaving all around the truck like a madman. <laughs> come come on, just don't crash you two. Just do it cleanly. Do it like they do in F1. He has more set fastest left, so he has good pace. He has the pace. And new I will. Trying to get the position back, don't dare to crash. Good. No crashing. No crashing allowed in this yeah. household. <laughs> See, we have FG, who in the meantime got and past Fitzwater. Gonzalez! Against Blackwood. Blackwood either is just very slow or has more fuel than the others. And here we go, the cars Yo, are flying, oh. and uh, but no regression will really get out of the the Gonzales. Yeah, it seems he's like he's moving, losing all the time. Yeah, it's, that's true. No, he doesn't move anymore. There's more than another fastest lap. And he's out. out. Yeah, he is out of the race. Let's see, diamond number seven. Is FG P12, third, P8. Now there's a freeway battle between Blackwood. Well, not three way battle, but seriously, just got away. Is Koenig attacking Blackwood? It's very slow. Look at that, he lost six and a half tenths in the last sector alone. Yep, uh, probably the fighting is, of course, affecting that as well. Yeah. But still, not a great pace from Blackwood. So let's go to the background, there's... I thought there were two cars going side by side, but not. So we reached half point, the halfway point of the race. Just oh. off leading by 17.5 seconds. Uh, so, uh, he goes around the outside! Oh. <laughs> what a brilliant move from the German! Finally, something positive! <laughs> <laughs> it was an amazing overtake for Mauro König. Great stuff, and here's probably going to be how it's not supposed to go. Yep. But it's still clean. At, so least, at so least the cars are trying to keep it clean. To an extent. Yeah. Here's Nua Will at the back of our field. Our cells now once again extended the gap now to 17.793 seconds. Yeah, Sarsenov is having. And Fitz, what a pits! Sarsenov is having easy times. And yeah, Fitz, whatever yeah. is pitting. This is the first scheduled stop for the BMW yeah. driver. Yeah, the former K. David Morrison driver. In the top class, of course. Yeah, exactly. You start going through that right hander. I Nuba think Will. the Arfield Newberville battle is the closest on the track at the moment. And, uh, well, not anymore, because that was. <laughs> it was very. Good pass. 
And okay, maybe now Alfie can. <laughs> the now battle isn't over it, yet. Get it back. Easy. I don't know. It was like they were trying to give the position to each other. Yeah, just playing cat and mouse. And now the, the weaving. And uh, is the move done? No. No. I think they're still going side by side. And I feel I think will will he keep it? They are still side by side. And. Uh, Which one of them is going to get come out of ahead before? Looks like is it finally over? No, our field is still side by side. And here, Nua will get the place back or gains the place. I think he was behind at first. So some good driving on this track finally. Yeah. Starting to happen. Let me know flaps. Finally, they learn. Yeah. He is Carpenter. Blake Second. Moore is more spitting. And I think someone else is spitting. Yeah, but I don't know who. It's Koenig. It's just said I don't know, but then it showed up. Well, we're joining the race. P8 with someone get through. It's P8. No? Koenig also pits. Yeah, and he comes on P9. And I think FG is out of third. And he is Southern of the leader who will stay out for at least one more lap. Yeah. I it's think the, 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 fuel, the fuel consumption is quite low, so I cannot predict the proper uh, pitting laps anymore, so we just have to wait for them to pit. Yeah. A black would know it's in the pits. Is in front of the Red Bull garage. Yes, because Red Bull, Re Red Bull famously oh. raced in Ult in Alton Park in the <laughs> British GP of 2006. Wait, what? Is yeah. FG or taking Blackwood? Yeah, we're still yeah, seriously. I don't know. No, oh, it's someone is right behind him. It's the le leader, Shatsunov is pitting. Yep, also Martins is in. We have a few cars pitting this lap. Who would join those two in the pit stop? Seven point six seconds stop. And the carpenter <laughs> into the lead. Till the sleeve it's in the pits. <clears throat> Head of the Ferrari. Pit pits. 
the very show with the Toyota and drive so with the that one as Blake Morris is the fastest Morris it's another lap. fast lap. Yeah, again, he's uh, a, he's a very good pace. Yeah, he's ahead of Tildeslow. And chasing Jackson, who will probably beat soon. And who also was into the pits. Moratelli is in. We are on board with Andrei Satsunov. A name I've probably said wrong every single time, but we move. Yeah, we move, indeed. See this carpenter? Will you pit? No, I don't think so. Wait, and here's the Blake Moore. Pit straight yet. Yeah. The carpenter isn't. Moore's overtaking Jackson. I think the fresher tires are really better, so I think the undercut is stronger here. Yeah, looks like. Yeah, but the... <laughs> the other loss still leads. Capitals to the second, more. Back in the third. FG is in the pits. Our field is also in. Also leaving. Jackson was in. Does anyone need to pit actually? Yet? Mm, let's see who needs to pit. It's going to be. I think everyone pitted at this point. Everybody has pitted now. So, no more pit stops, it's just a sprint to the finish. Yeah. yeah the sprint in the feature is, I like it. He is thousand of completing his 22nd lap, beginning his 23rd lap, and set the fastest lap in the meantime. 130.7. Yeah, I would say, here so far, this race, the last few laps has been quite clean. Yeah, because the cars are not close to each other. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't thought I would say that that's a good thing. It's still the same the fastest lap. Yeah, but... Really good thing that, that they are so... Spread out onto the circuit. More is catching Carpenter a little bit. Let's look at the gap between Zazanov and Carpenter 21 seconds. As officers chilling out of foot. Yeah. I don't know what on board this is. An interesting camera angle. That's why with this mod I haven't used the automatic camera as much. Yeah. <laughs> Here's more telly. Here's more. Third. Seriously lost two and a half tits. <sighs> Yeah. 
Give me more chasing carpenter. For a second. And uh, now the gap is 2.4. And another interesting camera angle as EFG says it's the fastest lap. Yeah, I think this camera angle we had already in this race. Yeah, at least we know who is driving the car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was about to say we even don't know where we are, but yeah, we have eight laps to go. Yeah, ah, they're getting tired now. Yep, same. <laughs> This is Carpenter, far Car back. Carpenter is losing time to more. And he is the Irishman. I would like to see the gap between the top two. Of course Carpenter. It's losing time again to more. Here's the leader who's going to definitely get an easy win out of here after taking his yes. main driver out or <laughs> used used the track bug to do that. But yeah, we can't blame him for that. Yeah, now the gap is under two seconds between Carpenter and Moore. Could be very close in the end. Yeah, only few laps remaining, but... Yes, seven to be exact. <laughs> yeah. He is the dominating leader, gap 22.299 seconds. I'm going to be honest, yeah. I do think... I do think he would have won regardless, but I think the gap would not be anywhere near as big if the race was normal. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, the gap between... No, that's more until there's left, so... So, no change there. It is... Big, not big gap, but... Constant gap. Trying to catch but the... But I think that... Trying to catch the BMW. Yeah. But I think for that enough that this this would be let me see his second win of the season after winning the f sprint race at Donning Park. Yeah, exactly. And uh, he will extend the championship lead. Yeah. Of course, the winner is getting 15 points. Yeah. It's also a top 10 system, but not the F1 system. Yeah, which means that yes. I don't know how it works. Yes. And uh, Satsunov makes a mistake, but nothing too serious. Yeah. Yeah. For you, it's good that Joe is making the championship standing so you don't need to worry about the points system I mean Im imagine me counting this <laughs> it will be <laughs> there will be no champion 
And he, oh, he have some, finally a battle. Yeah. Yeah, after the incident happens, we don't want to see a battle. And now, yeah, there finally is a battle. <laughs> we missed it. Let's hope it's a clean one, at least. Yeah. And it is a clean one. And as we have five laps remaining for the leader, then for everyone else. The Blackwood is in the meantime down to seven. Even behind third. Yeah, let's what? take a look at this. So, the gains. So, Koenig, 12 positions, more 11 positions. The biggest gainers. Blackwood loses 5 places. Yeah. And Arfield, 3. And here could be the battle for the final point between FG and Jackson. I think it might be an easy move for FG. Yeah, he goes already. Yeah, there. That's, that, yeah, was, that was ridiculously <laughs> easy. Yeah. This could mean that Jackson doesn't have any tires Jack left. Jackson has no fight left. Meanwhile, Fitzwater yeah, is fighting. Oh, look, Nielsen did it better. And, uh, yeah. no. You were saying. God and damn he's it. out. Emily Nielsen out of his race. The bow survived. I think that was the commentator's curse. Sadly, it's Definitely. expected in this track. This way, four laps remaining, gap 23 seconds. Yeah, I think more isn't catching that much. No. Yeah, so I think to make the track work better, I do think this, uh, the, the chicane could be made, this chicane could be made, or the chicane where they all crash like it, it's. Which, where is it? God damn it. Perkele. Where are you, chicken? Well, I can't find the chicken. But like, if it was made, if it much was made smoother, and possibly the tire wall removed, I think the track will be more raceable. Yeah, that's of course, it's I true, think, I guess. I think the rest of the things from this track's track could be fixed with track settings. We have three laps to go. Three laps to go, and I'm in a massive hurry now. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely did not expect this to take two and a half hours. Uh, I expected that, to be honest. And by our field. Oh, oh. By a great time. That was a huge crash again. FG, did he survive? Yeah. Arvich, he didn't. Yeah, oh. it's just. Yeah. It's the same thing again and again. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> it's a big one. The people in the There's jet would go. Crazy again. L look at the. Uh, there's literally uh, like. What? There's literally chassis in the truck. Yeah. And here's Fitzwater. Of course, he Fitzwater Andy, hits the. Of course, it's Fitzwater who hits it. Oh no. I think he needs a bit. I mean, who else? <laughs> he would have gotten points if he didn't. Oh. 
And now he has to fit. Zach refits water, and that's to prove he is the unluckiest. So we have an OC. And there's no. Let's see how they change the hall. Oh, that's. The FG is also in. Yeah, FG has to change a lot of things in his car. But yeah, and he, because of that, Moratelli in the Mazda is in the points. Yeah, so we have two laps to go. Maybe Fitzwater and FG can push for the fastest lap to save one point. Is the leader gap so huge? At least somebody's had an easy race here. Yeah. Let's say it this way he is, this would probably in the bag. If nothing happens. I will be surprised if something happens. Yeah. Same here. Yeah, all of the nobody else is actually fighting for positions, so we can have a look at Sarsanov going into his final lap of the race very soon. Yeah, we only have 13 cars remaining, which means only 9. We have 9 retirements, like last season. Yeah. So, history repeats itself. Yeah, we are on the final lap of this race. Thank God. This has been something else, and I will never yeah. pre-record anything on a Monday anymore. <laughs> yeah. Of course, when this goes live, it's probably probably Sunday. Yeah, indeed. Yeah, so I'm going to do that again for the last time. I'll also do the chaotic chicane. He goes through. Okay, heading towards. This next girl at the corner here, where we've seen lots of huge crashes. Yep, and now into the, the final corner he comes. Much <laughs> not as close as the sprint race, let's say. Not even. But and yeah. Andrei Zazanov wins the feature race at Alton Park. Interlagos, wait, Alton Park. Yeah. <laughs> oh, here's another fun team name BMW Motorspo BMW. Also, FC with the Volvo Volvo. Uh, Carpenter yes. P2 finish, for Camper, Carpenter. And close finish for P3 and P4 between Moore and Tildeslev. And here is Koenig. Close, but not that close. Koenig with he the is. red BMW in P5. Yep, indeed. He comes over the line to get Stuart P6. I think 8 points. 10 Blackwood. Yep. Well yeah, it's shut up, team radio. <laughs> uh, Jackson P9. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. I think Jackson. Scored his first points, but I'm not sure. Don't know if he finished in the points in the feature race. Way far back. In the sprint race, might mean. Way far back, Caio Moratelli. Coming to yeah. get the final point position. I think. Yep. It's one point for Moratelli. And there we go, Martins P13, and that's the race At over. Last. And we will do the rundown very quickly. Yeah, what 
what the chaos. Yeah, uh, just, just uh, to quick look at the lap chart. So, yeah, uh, Satsunov led the most of the way. Uh, Igor Peter led a, a little bit <laughs> before things yeah. happened. Same for the Barros. And uh, so, in the race chart, Satsunov wins, Carpenter second, Moore third, Tildesley fourth, Koenig fifth, Stuart sixth, Blackwood seventh, Neuville eighth, Jackson ninth, Moratelli. 10th, Fitzwater 11th, Miran 8th, 12th, and you do the rest. Fast. <laughs> In 13th, we have Jonathan Martins, one lap, one lap down. Michael Arfield, 14th, still classified. Emil Nilsson, Vino Gonzalez, Bruno Bowers, Julian Almeida, Tobey Holloway, Simon Mutka, Iko Peter, and Patrick Borghi all retired due to crashes. Yeah, and the fastest lap of the race goes to Miran Evci. And that's the Alton Park round over for BTCC. Uh, see, you all, chaos. see you all next time for wherever the next race is. And whenever it is. So, see ya.